Davis from Bellevue. Please like and subscribe. My mom was a maid at a big mansion, and we both lived in a small room there. It wasn't bad, but I always wondered what the other big rooms were like. Once when I was four, I sneaked upstairs for the first time and walked into a fancy bedroom. There was a giant bed, and whoa, it was so soft and bouncy. I climbed up on it and jumped like crazy. Suddenly, someone came out of the restroom and shouted, Ew, what are you doing in my room? That was Mrs. Darcy, the rich lady who owned the house with her husband. I immediately jumped down and tried to run away, but I bumped into Mr. Darcy at the door. What's this girl doing here? Isn't she the maid's daughter? Yes, honey. I don't know why she's here. Let me check if she's stolen something. No, nothing. But can I take this bed? Um, but then where will you sleep? So can I just jump on it one last time, please? <laughs> oh, this girl is smart and cute. He put me back on the bed and said I could play there for as long as I wanted. He was so sweet. But seeing Mrs. Darcy glaring at me, I ran out that instant. A few days later, we heard Mrs. Darcy was pregnant, and soon, little Bella was born. Though she was four years younger than me, we grew up like best pals. And when it was Bella's time for school, she insisted that I leave my public school and join hers instead. And Mr. Darcy happily agreed. I was super nervous about the new school, but my classmates were cool, and I made friends quickly. I was doing really well in my lessons, too. But sadly, Bella got all Fs in her exams. From that day on, I started helping Bella with her homework. Soon I realized something, though. She wasn't reading or writing at a normal pace like other kids. I tried speaking to Mr. Darcy, but his wife would never let me near him. So when Bella got bad grades again, I went with her to get the report card signed by her parents. Mr. Darcy looked a bit upset, but her mom wasn't bothered at all. Come on, honey. She has years to learn. Relax. But, ma'am, I think Bella has some difficulty in learning. Don't bluff, because you got all A's. You're not some teacher. My daughter is perfectly fine. She even tried to prove it a few days later at Mr. Darcy's birthday party, announcing that Bella was going to read out a poem for her dad. Oh, poor girl. She was stuttering at the...